Aquarius, thank you for tuning in to Perfectly Imperfect Tarot. This is Green Eyes here with your reading. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Martians, Astronauts. Pick a note. It does not matter to me. I love you all. Cross Watchers, I am a snitch. I'm telling you now. Please don't curse me in the comments. Love you too. Aquarius, this is a judgment-free zone, but you will hear the truth. There's no gender or age, only energy. You're going to hear me use terms he, she, her, him, they, them, it, heifa, pay it, no mind. Feel the energy. Remember, roles can always be reversed. Aquarius, I thank you. Like, share, subscribe, emails, comments, love tokens, donations. Thank you, thank you, and I thank you again, my love. Ooh. All right, let's talk about your energy. Heavy Knight of Pentacles. Very, very slow. I feel assured, but God dang it. Um, the night is almost there. I'll say that. Okay. But I don't feel like there's nothing that you're supposed to do to quicken this energy. I think it's coming directly to you and it's going to land in your lap. The problem is you actually have to wait for it, you know? So in the mean and in between time, while you're expecting this opportunity or this blessing, um, to come through for you, it's like you're twiddling your thumbs like, okay, I'm being patient, but uh, I'm just saying, checking the why, hello, you know? <laughs> the great thing about the Knight of Pentacles energy is that it's absolutely assured. This is what you, you can depend on it. You can put 10 toes down on it. Um, that night is coming. You just never know when he's going to get there. That You just never know. And this energy is like, it's draining on you. Um, because you're waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. And it's like, come on, man, you know? <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can get some, at least some details, um, to assist with this energy. Can I have Aquarius, please? Please and thank you. Mm -hmm. Exchanging a gift. So you definitely have a gift coming in. And you actually have something to give in return. Lovely. But you're definitely, it's coming. Like I said, it's somebody is coming to bring you a gift, bring you that pinnacle. And there's nothing that, you know, what are you supposed to do about that? You just have to wait for it to happen. When it does happen, um, there is an opportunity that comes in with it. I think your exchange is honestly going to be gratitude, okay? Um, but the truth is coming in or an, a window of opportunity is coming in or an exposure is coming through to make you see things clearly. It's like um, your window of opportunity to kind of like, that's what I was waiting for. I'm out of here. Okay. That's what I was waiting for. Let me make this move. That's exactly what I needed to know. Okay. Now, um, everything is not going to work the way you planned it. I'm going to tell you the truth. Okay. It's not. Expect the unexpected. Expect the unexpected. Okay? It's just it's just flowing with this energy. Yeah. Definitely expect the unexpected. I think that you need to, yeah, you need to um, be aware of who you're trusting with your personal information, um, with your plans. Okay? Be aware of that. Because I don't feel that they're as loyal as they portray, okay? Even if, even if this is business and maybe you hired an attorney or you hired, it feels more like an, a, a teacher, like you're hiring a teacher to teach you something. And honestly, I just think that they're intentionally um, not teaching you everything or they're um or they lied about their credentials okay hold on i'm getting a deck i think we want to go with secret today yeah so be mindful of that as well okay there's some tricky energy in here but i'm not worried about that yeah there's a tricky energy 
I'm telling you, you're not gonna like it, but I'm not worried about that. My concern is I wanna get you this blessing ASAP because even though you have to deal with the tricky energy, it's not gonna take away from the opportunity. It's just gonna make you um, pivot your course, okay? If you were planning on taking the plane, you might have to take the train, that kind of thing, all right? It's gonna, it, you're gonna pivot your course. Can I have the core for Aquarius? Thank you. See ya. This is manna. It's what you need when you need it. But it's stable. It's a stable energy, the Six of Pentacles. All right? It keeps you balanced. It does uh, seem unfair, but it really is fair for the moment, for that moment in time. Because right now, there's, like I said, all you really kind of have to do is contain yourself, control yourself. Um, stand um, until this opportunity comes in. There's nothing else that you can do. And you will be blessed and abundant, but you got to get this information so that you can see what you need to see. And that way, while you're moving into your next journey, you'll heal, but you'll grow at the same time as you should. Hello, as you should. Crown this energy for Aquarius. Oh, man, that Empress smells so good on you, babe. Yeah, Will of Fortune. It's time. There's going to be um, this exchange. Yeah, that's why I felt like I said it before and I'll say it again. Some An opportunity is coming in for you and what you have to give it in return is gratitude. I'm telling you, the Wheel of Fortune, remember, the wheel turns uh, by way of energy. Energy wields the wheel. Okay, so while I know it might seem like you're standing around twiddling your thumbs waiting for your blessing, keep your energy high, keep your uh, optimism high, keep your frequency high, focus on your future, focus on your new beginning, focus on the love of, of the most high, uh, the, focus on the most high that's in you regardless of your circumstances because that's going to wield this wheel. Now, once this wheel turns, the abundance can pour in for you to be able to make that move but it's going to be honestly a little disheartening because like i said there's a tower coming with this there's a there's a reveal of some sorts coming in with this something you didn't know okay something you didn't know what's working against aquarius so at the same time you're going to get your blessing somebody else is going to get some karma cancer pisces scorpio could be um Oh, you mother lover. You smell that? Cancer and Pisces. Heavy. Okay. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Um, oh, what was I even saying? That threw me off. I'm sorry. Pisces is literally in my mouth. Like, it's really heavy energy. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with the King of Cups. He's the father of emotions. Okay. Remember, he doesn't wear his emotions on his sleeve. Because he has emotional control, maturity, intelligence, all right? Be mindful of responding uh, with your emotions. That's number one. Number two, a lot of you are connected to a Pisces or Cancer specifically, or somebody that's operating in the King of Cups energy, meaning somebody that's trying not to let you know um, how they feel or let you see their emotions. I'll say it like that. They don't want you to know. They don't want you to see their emotions. So they're controlling their emotions, okay? This could be a love for you, but it feels like a lying love. It's like somebody, I don't know, they, um, they misrepresented themselves and I think it's about to get exposed. Now, granted, the decision is still yours, Aquarius, yeah, the decision is still yours. And honestly, you know, you guys have a tendency to stick around. Your loyalty is definitely strong, but this person doesn't know you very well, as, as well as they think, you know? And that's because of the mixed signals that you give this person. Being an Aquarius, you know how y'all are. You know, you can hide your cuckoo whenever you want. You know what I'm saying? So you can make, you have that uh, ability to, 
even sway a conversation, to sway an emotion, to sway a thought. It's that natural air of you, all right? So this person might be a little confused on maybe how you'll receive their truth. But the way they're going about it is so deceitful that it's going to feel like a betrayal. I'm not going to lie. Past energy, there it is. Five of Swords. Some kind of game being played here, guys. It's some kind of manipulation, and it's affecting your new beginning all the way around this. It's affecting your new... It's like they're going to give you a... You know, if you love me, you'll overlook this. If you love me, you'll stay. If you love me, you know, uh, you'll forgive me. And Aquarius, you're not God. You know, God love heals all, forgives all. God knows all. Your name is Aquarius. I'm just saying. And that's what they got confused. I don't know. <laughs> Hello? I'm just saying. Future energy, please. Where are we going with this? For Aquarius. Please and thank you. Yeah, there's going to be some regret. Some shoulda, woulda, couldas. Focus on the positive. Remember, the Five of Cups is an energy that can be manipulated he's focusing on spilled milk but he has something to drink right here so it might not be as much but you're not completely without you know and it creates room for change and your new beginning that's why i said there's going to be an alteration on your plans this has to happen because it's going to change your plans if this was going to be a group trip we're going to lose a couple people you know what i'm saying <laughs> everybody not going and they weren't meant to they weren't meant to but this is going to change the foundation of the foundation of what you were standing on before because like i said i feel like you had a plan and the plan is changing so it might be a little difficult. It doesn't change your abundance, but it might be a little difficult at first because you're going to have to make a quick decision or a quick change. You're leaving either way. You're moving on either way. You're going forward either way, however you want to word that. You're going to your son. You're going to your happy. You're going to the bigger, better, brighter, okay? Um, because you're trying to operate in, under this wisdom of the hermit. You're operating in the form of, I know... Uh, I, what I did before when I did it wrong. So now I'm going to make sure I do it right kind of energy. Remember, the wisdom is the application of the knowledge. It's not just knowing what to do, but actually doing it. Okay. And that's what you're deciding on. You're just waiting for this mother lover right here to come in with this pinnacle so you can have your start. And man, that's why I call it a turtle with hemorrhoids. But he's coming in just not with the pinnacle. He's coming in with the sun. Uh, he's going to reveal. He's going to give you the pinnacle, but it's coming in with a reveal, and it's going to alter your destiny. It's going to alter your life choice. It's going to alter your direction with this lover's energy. might even be your relationship. I'm not going to lie, okay? Either way, you're good. You know how to defend. You know how to protect yourself. You know how to stand. You know, you know how to fight for your right to party, but will you? You know, but will you? You kind of toss it back and forth. I ain't going to lie. Um, you have assistance coming in with the six of cup, emotional assistance to kind of balance you so that you can th think straight. Uh, it's also past life assistance because this may be about a relationship that is, uh, some type of, uh, divine connection, twin flame, soulmate, things like that. Okay. Um, so this person might say, you know, please accept this. I apologize, or please accept this as proof of my intentions um in the future so this person is giving you a pinnacle but the most high is giving you the boomstick i'm just saying i'm just saying aquarius like i said the choice is yours and i know you guys can be extremely loyal to who and what you love but you got somebody giving you a pinnacle and you got the most high giving you this boom boom stick right here power passion fertile abundant energy changing events of your life birthing changes in your life unga bunga your way through any pain any heartache anything stepping right into 
your power, your true form with the star, okay? And you know that's when it's your time to shine. It's just your time to shine. But the Most High is so good to us. And we live on this grace that he still allows us free will to choose. The choice is going to be yours. So if you're going to stick to your guns, like you've been saying, no, I'm focusing on my future. I'm focusing on my kingdom. I'm focusing on my goals, uh, you know, like this king of wands. But you see the enemy right here and trying to block your view. You understand? You step into that passion and there's the enemy. Look at me trying to block your view. And you just trying to get to your happy. But you got to take this king's energy and bypass this enemy to get to your happy. Because the enemy wants, of course, to separate you from this. Keep that in mind. So when you have that page offering you that pinnacle and the most high offering you that boomstick... It might seem at first to that person as a betrayal, but you have to go with what has been divinely leading you up until this point because you're meant to go further, all right? Like I said, they're not going to like it. They're not going to like it. They're going to talk, oh, Aquarius, it's Aquarius' fault. They just up and left. You know, I gave Aquarius everything. And they just used me and took me. Oh, it's so many lies in the seven of swords. I'm ready to fight. Hold on. Ooh, let me hold my own emotions. Ooh, you mother lover. Ooh, you mother lover. Okay, hold on. I got to breathe, y'all. Aquarius, wait a minute. Y'all got me involved here. Let me pull it in. This is a lion so-and-so that's playing games, going from house to house, creating all this daggone confusion. And you're... Sorry. I was going to, uh, I got to say it. And, and they're getting help from their family because this person, it feels to me like their mother is like the, the, the ringleader or the, the source of, of, oh, you, it's pissing me off. Anyway, um, the truth is, it will always be the truth. Facts will always be facts and they cannot be changed just because somebody got a made up story, uh, mixed in with their feelings and a whole bunch of lies. Stand on that mother loving truth. You have your intuition. You have knowledge. You have know-how. You are being divinely led. You are being divinely blessed. You know what you need to do. Okay. This is coming to an end so that you can begin and you're beginning in an abundant way and god dang it it's going to get better from here okay it's going to get better from here oh your mother somebody's mother is pissing me off i'm so sorry aquarius like urgh, you know it's it, it, like it's not even the family not that they're worth a quarter either but the mother where the heck go oh i smell you Hold on, because I want to put some, see if I can put a sign to that. Let me just stop. I got to calm down. God darn, where did she go? Where's that seven of swords? Where did she go? Did I put it back? No, because you were fighting it with the, there's a confusion. There's the house to house. Right, this was the family. There you go, you mother love. Hold on, I'm going to tell you that. Hold on, hold on. Um, she likes the color green you itch bay um she likes the color green i'm not sure if it's to wear or she's just very money hungry but she likes the color green and um oh i need a sign give me a sign hold on pisces is here i have to say that i'm sorry pisces is in cancer manipulation emotional manipulation okay I'm trying to go past that so I can get, I know somebody's hiding behind this water. So just give me a second. Um, I got to say Capricorn and somebody else is here. Hold on. Gemini, is that you? You nasty. Is that you? Oh, it's a Gemini. <laughs> Gemini. Oh, Gemini is playing a role. See, that's the thing about Gemini energy. They know how to, uh, they know how to change their clothes. They can put on any energy. Well, we all can, but Gemini is really good at it because they're a dual energy in self. So that chameleon energy, okay? Oh, man. I'm going to tell you what they say. They always insinuate 
togetherness, but never follow through. It's always for the show. Did that make sense? Let's get together. Let's do this together. Uh, let's go together. You know, when you're all around people, it's always for the show. Mother lover. <laughs> all right. Don't tell Gemini's I told y'all. Aquarius, I love you so much. I hope this helps, okay? If any event, you say, listen, green eyes, I don't know you. You don't know me. This is not my life. I'm okay with that. Check your moon. Check your rising. Don't take the energy if it's not yours. Leave it here for someone else, okay? Everybody, thumbs up, subscribe. Make sure you guys are notified of future readings. It's free and it supports the channel. If you're interested in a personal appointment, email me, perfectlyimperfecttarot at gmail.com. Other than that, guys, remember, we are all perfectly imperfect. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye.